Here we have residence one. It's gonna be 2,900 square feet, uh, four beds, three and a half bath, and you are gonna be getting, you're right on, you're the closest to the view out of the, out of the rest of them, the rest of the residences, I should say. Walking right in, you have this turquoise door here, and then you walk in and you are met with this massive open floor plan. Right off the bat, you have your kitchen and oversized island here. This monogram stove, the brass finishes. I do like that backsplash as well. You have your microwave oven. Living room, dining room, everything is connecting. So nobody will feel left out when, when you guys have a party in here or just have family or friends over. is pretty neat. The staging done here is phenomenal. They really do hit it out of the park when they do stage these homes. Let's check out the backyard really quick. You have a nice patio area here. You do have the coyote grill with this gorgeous marble. I mean, wherever they source this, it is perfect. You have a little fridge there as well, and a fireplace, which is pretty neat. This is the only unit with a backyard, um, or only residence, I should say, with a backyard. So that is a huge plus when it comes to this residence one. Let's check out the first bedroom down here. You have your full bath right off of the living room. And then here you have your first bedroom. Double closet doors there. Awesome. Let's make our way I forgot to mention, you do have your garage right through that door. Um, you guys can imagine what a garage looks like. That is indeed what it does. And here you have massive, massively tall ceilings. I mean, I think that is almost 30 feet top to bottom as this is th three stories. Each story is about 10 feet or so, give or take 10 to 12 feet, just depending on how they construct them. Right off the bat, you kind of have two ways you could go, bedroom upstairs or through this loft area. Throughout this home, it is a black and white theme. It really gives it an elegant feel when walking through here. You have your washer and dryer upstairs, which is perfect if you don't want to do too much walking. And then right off the bat, you have this master bedroom and bath. I mean, this thing is, is massive, to say the least. I mean, this could be a room all by itself. This room right here. Large walk-in shower tub. Here you have a walk-in closet. Perfect if you have a lot of things or clothes that you need to store away. And the master bath, or master bedroom, sorry. 
I've been touring these houses all day, so I apologize for mixing up my words there. But very, very neat master bedroom here. You do get that insane view from your patio and room, which is neat. This is the biggest one out of the four bedrooms. As expected. And again, the wall details do not disappoint throughout any of these homes. Let's make our way over to the other bedrooms on the other side here. Pretty neat size. They got the Angel Wings, City of Angels. As we are in LA after all, here you have the second bedroom on this side. They kind of got the, the car theme through here. This is a Porsche 357, I want to say, or the Speedster. It's the Speedster. Um, Porsche lovers down below in the comments, let me know what the Speedster number is. Um, is that is a classic. Here you have your Jack and Jill style sinks, restroom, shower. Nothing too crazy there. Then you have this walkway up here. You can kind of peek over the ledge. And it's gonna lead upstairs to the second loft area. Check that out. Perfect if you want to have friends over. You guys can all hang out upstairs here. Play some shuffleboard. Should we take it for a spin? Oh, they don't have the sand on here, so it doesn't move uh, like it should. But it is a good decoration piece. Very nicely sized. And you have your half bath up here. Nothing too special. Just so you don't have to go downstairs if you do need to use the restroom when you are upstairs, which is always a great touch. And here you have your balcony. Rooftop deck, I should say, with that gorgeous, gorgeous view. I mean, I'm gonna zoom in for you guys so you guys can take a better look. But it is pretty neat. And that concludes the home tour. I will catch you guys in the recap in just a moment. What a fantastic home that we just toured. If you guys have been keeping up with this Lennar extravaganza, you know that this is the pinnacle, uh, quite literally and figuratively, because this is the biggest lot that they do have here in this community. Let me know what was your guys' favorite part down below in the comments. I would love to know. Personally, my favorite part, it had to have been that third story kind of loft living area with the patio outside. I truly loved that space there. It kind of felt like you could kind of make it into a man cave or just kind of a game room. Just an awesome place to hang out uh, in my opinion. I really did enjoy the layout of the home as well. You kind of have your main bedrooms on the second level. You have that loft area on, and patio on the top, kind of that rooftop deck. And then on the bottom, you do have kind of your main living area with your kitchen. You also have a backyard um, there as well. And the don't not, or for, I forgot to mention that rooftop deck was absolutely phenomenal. I mean, the views from here are amazing just because you are at the top of the hill um, here in San Gabriel Valley. Uh, 
specifically Montebello. And it's, it's a very nice view. You kind of have a, a 270 degree aerial kind of view, um, which is nice if you do enjoy that. I mean, I could see myself sitting up there and reading a book, um, enjoying a nice drink. And it is um, great if you are looking for that. And if you guys wanted to tour this property or any other properties in the area, my phone number and email will be on the screen. Do not hesitate to reach out as I am here to help. And don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. I know 90% of you guys are not subscribed to the channel, so it would mean a whole lot if you just hit that button down there. It takes two seconds and make sure you hit that notification bell to stay in the loop because we are coming out with new videos every single week. And if you guys enjoyed that video, click right here. It's gonna show you a recommended video that I'm sure you will enjoy and click on this side to go ahead and uh, subscribe to the channel. It would mean a whole lot. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful day so far and I will catch you guys on the next video. Take care.